Geza Krause, congratulations with your win here in Cheboksari in the 3000 meter steeplechase. You were winning with a big lead. Yes, I didn't expect that because I know about my competitors and they are all really strong. But I'm happy that I got 12 points for my country. You win out slow or not too fast? Actually, I plan to run 3.10 on a K, but today the conditions are really hard. It's really windy and, um, of course, pretty warm. So I decided to go out a little bit slower because I know I have um, speed on my last K and so I want to use this one. How is your season going? Actually pretty good. I got my A standard for Beijing in my first race in Rome. I placed ninth there, but it's a long season and so I can improve my time and that's the main goal, to improve my time and then make the final in Beijing. Did you found your motivation back? Yes, I definitely found it back. I had a really great winter training. I went to Kenya three times. I went to Flagstaff for altitude training and I have a nice group I'm training with and it was a tough season in 2013. Of course in 2014 I placed fifth and I actually wanted to win the gold medal in Zurich but that didn't work out. But um, so I think I can improve now and I want to go forward and look forward and I hope I can go back to faster times this year. Do you know what was the key that you found your motivation back? I think I was pretty young and I had a really high goals and I achieved everything in my um, young career and I think it's really hard sometimes to get motivated and I have to figure out the right training for me and that took some time and I was angry with myself but I think some things just need t their time and training not always improve um, if you're getting better in training you also need the strength back in competition and now you also said you have been training in Kenya how was that actually it was my seventh time this year I started in 2010 but for this season I'd been there three times for a month and it was really hard but I mean it's the place where the best athletes in the world come from and it's really motivating to be there it's really hard to train there but it also strengthens your body a lot and I love that but sometimes it needs some time to get the training into your body and then bring it on the track well, if you have been training in the winter in Kenya, do you also sometimes go on altitude during the summer season or not? Yeah, actually I'm planning to go to Switzerland in summer, um, a place that's close to St. Moritz. We go to Davos, it's a little bit lower, but uh, I've been there last year too and the training is good, the surface is nice and I love Switzerland. So, And it's also uh, pretty close to Germany, so I can go back from nationals and that's the plan for a summer. What will be your next uh, important race uh, towards Beijing? Um, I'm actually planning to train for a couple of weeks and then I think I will compete in the 1500 again to work a little bit on my speed. I also will do a 3000 steeplechase, maybe Monaco, but I'm not sure about that. And then um, I have nationals in Germany, so I'm fighting for the German title, but we all know there's other German who's pretty strong, so it uh, will be a tough competition for me nationally, because Antje Meltner schmidt won the European medal last year at the goal, and um, after that I will train again for Beijing and there won't be any competitions.